everyone welcome to the podcast yes today we'll be talking about the place of building the place of friendships in building long lasting relationships yes and now i am not alone in the studio i have two very awesome personalities with me first and foremost to my immediate right i have a very beautiful damsel and then much more beyond her we have a prolific spoken word artist a very handsome young man in his prime yes yeah, so please i'll leave introductions to them to handle can we hear you thank you my name is as one of the name chuku from naya and uh, i'm currently serving my country nigeria i'm happy to be here thank you all right okay my name is daniel a spoken word artist a public speaker and also I run my own personal business, a tech company. So I'm very glad to be here. Thank you. All right. We are um, privileged to have you guys in the studio today. Thank you so much for making our time to be here. So we'll go straight right into the heart of the matter today. Yes. And our topic for the discourse is friends or lovers. Now, you agree that there are two extremes for which people have stood for quite um, a duration of time. So we have people who are on the side of uh, marry your friend and not your lover. And you have people on the other extreme that are on marry your lover and not your friend. So today we're going to um, go into it, we're going to analyze it and see what we can draw out from that. So first and foremost, uh, Master Dan, what do you think about that concept? Are you on, e on either extremes or if you are not on either extremes, um, is there a balance for you? It is said that the balance to things is not always at the middle. So would you strike a balance to that if you are not on either um, extremes of the, of the analogy? Wrong. Okay, marry your friend, marry your, lo your lover. It's a case by case difference. It's a case by case difference. Like it works either ways. Uh, you can marry your lover, it's work. You can marry your friend and it will still work but talking statistically which one of these two is stopping the chat so and according to my chat and according to my own research marrying your friend it's more prolific it's more it's more essential and then it produces more results mm. good results and good reports than marrying your lover so because when we are talking about marrying your friend, when you marry your friend, you marry someone you know in and out. Mm. Because mm. there's a saying that says a friend will know bad things about you and everything about you and he will, he will still love you. Mm. That's what friendship does. Mm. Friendship will give you the platform where you love someone for who the person is and then no matter the lapses and the topsy turvy experience mm. you still love that person but it doesn't work in marrying your lover or in love settings yes yeah because more often times love cloud your sense of reasoning mm. okay so if you say okay this is my lover but you people are not friends you can be a lover but you're not friends mm yeah so you love the person if if the person calls you you, you don't want to drop the call mm. if the person say okay let's say you want to go to law school or yeah. you want to study law the person will say no i don't want you to study law you just obey instantly <laughs> without thinking so your senses are put on hold because love has already Cloudy. Cloudy, yeah, 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 your sense of reasoning. So that's the disadvantage and, and the effect or the defect of all this love, 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 love. Okay. But, you know, we don't fall in love, we grow in love. And you okay. can't grow in love without good friendship. Mm. Yeah. Your love doesn't just fall from heaven. Mm. You grow in love. So you need that friendship for you to establish a good and a godly love or a standard love. But when you just, you know, everyone's love is hung on the premise of interest. So if you just love somebody because of that interest, what if the interest is not there? Mm. What will happen? 
Mm. That's why it's 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 very it's very dangerous for you to marry. If there was someone your lover, you just carried away by love. You just want to marry this person. You know that's why we have cases of even when the parents are against it, your pastor is against it, your imam is against it, every other person around you is against it. You say no, I must marry this guy. I must marry this girl. I have a case right now of a young guy. He's a doctor, medical doctor, and then he's just twenty five years. 25 years right yeah yeah yeah. and then the lady he wants to marry and he said he must marry her she's around 36 years 36 that's hold on hold on hold on sir just for context the guy is 20 25, 25 yeah the lady is, is 37 37 37 yeah Ooh. and he said he must marry her all the families tried to intervene but he stood his ground that that's this love, is the love. person he loved and he must you see the the, the danger <laughs> of love <laughs> danger yes 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 but what was wrong what's the problem he is carried away by emotions but she's because she's older than him the age difference is too much so what what does the age difference have to do with the love even in friendship it's not all your friends that are in the same <laughs> age i know yes. i know but for a man it's dangerous and then everybody's against it you feel in, like including okay. his family members everyone everyone he respects everyone he is oh, accountable to. they are all against it okay so in a sense now are we saying it, it is they are against it because they are seen beyond what the, he okay. can see from yes. where he is apparently by virtue of the emotions apparently. Uh, that are apparently currently apparently oh are they just judging because it's of not the judging normal? It's not judging. Apparently, you know that something is wrong somewhere. Okay. Something okay. is what wrong. What could somewhere. possibly be wrong? Okay. That's that's <laughs> why like that's why I, I said earlier that like if you're carried by emotions, you cannot reason. Mm. You can't reason. Mm. Because instead of you to look at all that things and check, do check and balance in what are your parameters of of measurement? What are yeah. you checking? What how, what is the parameter you're using for your measurement? Yeah. Okay. So, um, Chikufuna, right? Um, I see that for a moment there, you did not agree. Yes. yes. Yeah, I could see your face, and then you would speak on that shortly. <laughs> so, from this scenario alone, now we can even draw out. We can even draw out the subject of yeah, discussion yeah, this yeah. morning, right now. So, we have a guy, twenty-five years old, yes, yes, yes. in love, madly yes, in love, yes, yes, yes. with a thirty-seven-year-old <laughs> yeah. lady. First and foremost, guys, can you do this? Yes, guys, please. Comments. We'd love to hear what you think. Yes, can you do this? You're a guy. You love a 37 year old. That's like 12 years difference. Would you do that, guys? Yes. Please let us know what you think about that. So we can now draw the both extremes now from this. Yeah, because in this same context, it's possible that the guy, right, 25 year old loves a 37 year old lady. It's possible that he can, he can be, he can do that because of. Okay, he has seen that they have been friends for over a very long time and he would love to build something with that lady, right? That's one our first extreme, which is marry your friend and not your lover. Then there's also another extreme where it can be that the guy is just moved by emotions yes, yes. for the lady. Now, in this context, we do not know if she's rich. We do, we do not know about the other benefits that maybe he may stand yeah, to gain. Yeah. That's another aspect to it. Yeah. But then we can just, for the con context of this discussion, draw up also that he may just be clouded by he, the emotions that he has sure. for her, the goosebumps that he has for her. Sure. You know, for guys, when we when we talk to ladies that we are interested in, you know how we hang our legs on the wall so we can lay on the bed and then we can hang our legs. That is common to guys. Almost every guy has done that. <laughs> Oh so don't go on calls. We just hang. We hang. <laughs> I'm telling you guys. I'm telling ladies. This is a secret now. Oh, no, a when we are on the other side of that call, we hang our legs on the wall. Oh, Those it calls are really interesting. So very phenomenal. Experience. Very phenomenal. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> if you're not, if, you have, if you've not experienced that, you are missing out. Yeah. But then, so if now we would like you to analyze um, that difference from from this um, situation we have in ground now. Okay. First of all, the I feel. She's 37, he's 25. He may be 25 by age, but his mind, yeah. his workings, how he's living may not even be. You know, there's people you see, you'll be like, ah, you're just 25. Yeah, okay. Do, do you understand? It, it yeah. may just be the age, really. It may not be anything. 
he may not be moving out of emotions really really everything may be said the girl maybe i don't know they just always have this thing like this side we have this thing like oh maybe if she's older the girl is trying to use him or because you know you know they there's this stereotype of when the girl is like 37 maybe she's just trying to get him to marry her because she now she's desperate. she's desperate it may not even okay. be like that okay funny enough that's what i'm saying like they may just be judging because of not judge let me look let me know his word judging yeah. and they may just be way. yes but you should try and understand where the guy is coming from he may not be coming from the place of emotions. just emotions it may be friendship emotions everything together okay it may not be okay so 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 you are saying now that he may be coming from where jacob came from right <laughs> <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah wait, <laughs> Jacob. but then guys let's yeah let's talk about this right uh, just quickly what did what did i think we'll, we'll do this some other time right yeah, but yeah. then what did he see in um rachel right that made him wait for and work for not your way to wait and work for 14 years can you do that guys I'm still weighing it in me, like if I have capacity to do that, like 14 years. Come on, that's that's, that's so... true love. True love yeah. is patient. True love, true love can wait. True love is not is not a uh, fast. Mm. True love follows process. Mm. So there are process to things. Let's say, for instance, if I want to marry her, yeah, and her father say. You have to wait for two years mm. and come back. You are just 14 years, you used to years. If I can't wait to come back into that show that I, I, I didn't love her at first. Mm. If after he told me that I just move and carry another down say, pew, <laughs> marry, <laughs> that shows that from the onset, you yeah. know, you wouldn't even know maybe the father is trying to test you. Yeah. To see your reaction. Yeah. That two years might be two months. That two years can be two, two weeks. Mm. And that's how God operates. Yeah. Are you ready to wait for God? <laughs> wow. That's wow. how it is. So true love waits. True, true love, love is patient. As I'm telling you, if you see any guy rushing you, rushing you, that's emotional love. It's not that he's coming from a depth of understanding or the standpoint of understanding. Yeah. Of he, he, in fact, he doesn't even value you. He only mm. value himself. That's self-centeredness. Yeah. So he's just rushing, rushing, mm. rushing. You, you, that's like rushing with emotion. Just imagine. Hasting the process. That, just imagine we just started talking for... The first week we started talking, I'm telling you about our future. We'll be we will born three mm. children. One will be named Jordan. Another one, David. <laughs> we, we, now, now. We, are, we are talking about future already. On yeah. that one week. Yeah. And we are not dealing with the present. Mm. So these are lapses you should check. Yeah. When these things are are, are, are being domiciled mm. in your relationship, wow, you should wow. run away from it. Wow. Yeah. I can't be talking to you for the first week and I'm talking about the future. Mm. Why not? Nah, no, 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 no. Yeah. No, yeah. no. We are supposed to know ourselves first. Yeah. I'm not supposed to yeah. scare you yeah. or to cajole you or to impel you to propel you or to compel you into you accommodating me because of these facts i'm throwing at your face mm. and that's what most people do if you see this sign that person is not coming down mm. so you need a man that calm down understands what all these things and then putting wow. all these things in place wow wow, wow. Mm. so I, I'm, I'm talking to the ladies now this is a yeah. red flag if you mm. see a guy behaving like it's a red flag yeah that's true yeah that's so true. if this thing's not part of your red flag your flag is not complete mm. Mm. Right. Thank you. Wow, 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 wow. Profound, <laughs> profound words there. Profound words there. You know, I think, I think that's deep. That's really deep. Yes, because, um, so we're saying in the sense that ladies need to learn to discern. Ladies can easily discern when a guy is genuine yeah. by what he does with time. Yeah, because I, I can, I, I'm trying to run it through my mind now, right? If I intend to build something, that would last. If I intend to build, to go into a relationship for the purpose of marriage with any lady, guess what? My uh, my entire plan, in my mind, I will spread it across a period of time. Yes? Because time give, gives room for process. Yes, yes, yes. Yes? Much more than, much more than when I just want to get into the pants of a lady. Then, 
automatically I know that okay, I want to get this done in two weeks. Yeah, so then all of my um five year plan <laughs> initially I compress it into yeah, 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 two weeks and bombard it, her. And how do I do that? Extra cool every night. Yes. Yeah, yeah. morning, afternoon, we'll evening. We are in the DM, morning after evening, we are calling, we are doing all of those things. Yeah. We are sending Goldstone, we are sending um, Pizza, Pizza Place, we are sending yeah. Glovo and all of that. Yeah. And all of that. So we bombard them with emotion. Because you know that yes. ladies receive, ladies are built to receive, right? Men are built to give. Yes, and we know that no matter how it is, ladies will, also, we, ladies will always receive. So men throw, guys throw a lot of attention and a lot of emotions their way. Yeah? To make them bring their guard down so that they can do whatever um their intent was in the beginning so ladies one of the ways from this now by which you can um, learn to tell if the guy is genuine is when is when he spreads his plan across yeah, time yeah. where he's yeah. not he's not in, in haste yeah, yeah, yeah to get anything done and like that's what i like what you said that a guy that really wants some wants something to do with you he will not be telling you about the future in one week he because he respects what he what he wants to do so much to take that risk and it's not just about him yeah if you're just talking about your future this you're just you're being particular about you 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 you, yeah. you don't even want to hear her own part <laughs> yeah you don't want That's to hear how, what is her perception what is how does she see life you don't want yeah. to hear your own is let her know me let her know me <laughs> yeah <laughs> i'm real uh, yeah so it's you now you just want her to know it's so like you fall in love with your personality mm. so you're trying to to alter her her belief yeah like her balance. Then, yes 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 yes, yes. you're yeah. trying to alter it and then and most guys they see girls as gullible they are gullible right yeah. ladies are gullible so many ladies are naive yeah yeah, yeah 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 so yeah, if yeah, i do yeah. this do this do this she no will fall in love with me if i yeah. show her money 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 like we are talking about one of our i don't want to say this so <laughs> say what <laughs> we're talking about one of our guy in the office so we're talking about it <laughs> The, I never knew that almost everybody in the office knew about the guy. So when we were talking about it, everybody was like, this guy, he doesn't know how to go about a lady, his own is just to show her money. <laughs> the guy is rich. Yeah. He doesn't know about his money. Like, he, he, he thinks, and then one of the ladies he likes in my office, the girl, in, the girl, she, she comes she came from a wealthy home uh, so there's money and he has, he's trying to show her money now who's someone who is not moved so yesterday the lady since she was not around that the lady was telling us that <laughs> this guy thought he has money say <laughs> say even the car is driving she wants to buy she'll buy it tomorrow <laughs> <laughs> what so she said she said that I, the people she dated that she was the one giving them money for feeding Mm. She was the one depositing money to the account every month, paying them salary. Mm. So she's not going for money. She's going for the things she sees in a person. Mm. So that's it. But I want her to strike a balance to all these yeah. things we are saying. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. From our own perspective. <sighs> that's the thing. When you don't know what you want as a girl. Okay. Do you understand? You, you can hear her say that um, she... It's not money she's looking for because it may not even be because she has it. Mm. She yeah, may still be true. somebody that doesn't even have so much, but she knows that that's not everything. Yeah. Do you understand? Yeah. So when you're bringing, I know that some men, that's the only way they can approach a girl. They yeah, just yeah. know how to show it Month, through, months, through months, money. Months. But that's what some girls still want. Yeah, true. true Do you understand? True. So when you are a girl and when you are very, you know how to see i'm not over your money right it's not your money that make you make it clear that you make them know that's how you can make a guy know they get, you don't even need to make him you will know that more. it's not my money this girl just even looking at mm, yeah. do you understand some girls that's what they want so a boy will, will give them then some boys that's only what they yeah. that's the only way they know how to express love that's what love is to them that if all their times of trying to love yeah. that's what maybe they maybe when they were even trying that maybe when they were in primary school or secondary school or even uni yeah, girls have tried to like, break them with money. yes you know when you hear them say maybe a girl left them for a guy that had money yeah, they yeah, will not yeah, feel yeah. like every other girl yeah mm. the only way they can yeah. get them is through money yeah. that's why you now see boys going into illegal means of getting money sure. to please mm. yeah. but that has not everything yeah. money is a plus you can't lie money makes everything easy even yeah. with men love yeah. it makes life easy for you you can't do certain things when you don't have money, money. yeah that's true do you like, understand? Money, there can't be this studio 
Uh, yeah, so I will not be seated. Yeah, without it's money, there will be no podcast. Right. So I'm not going yeah. to sit down and tell yeah. you that oh, money. No, it's important. Yeah, you important. get it. Is money? It's money. Make things. money look like money. Paper. Yeah. yeah. But that's yeah. not everything. So money is like a means to an end and not the end. Yeah. Means yeah. to yeah. an end. Yeah. No. That's so when you make money, be the, money is the only thing that can make your relationship happy, or your relationship stand. When the money is not there, or when there's not too much money, what else? You'll be bored. Yeah. People can't do yes. anything. So for so for um relationships in, in your in your own um perspective, I think earlier Mr. Dan was talking about emotional love and he was talking also about intentional um love, right? So in your own concept, in your own perspective, what do you think um or um to what effects do you think friendship has in building relationships? Friendship is high. Like you need friendship to build that relationship. You just need friendship as the found the foundation. Yeah. Do you understand? One of the foundation. Like why is that important? Why is friendship really important? <laughs> because can I not just can I not just um feel something for this lady today and say, come on. When the feeling, you know, funny enough, I I wish we had like married people here okay. because there's this thing I heard them say: love is never enough. Okay, love is never enough. Yes, love is not enough to keep the marriage. Okay. Love is not enough. You know, I've heard them. Many of them said, "I really want to even know their own." Like, what people really mean by this? Love is not enough. No, I, can't, I, can't I feel like it's in this. Yet. It's in this um, emotional love. I have experience. Like, it's in that emotional yeah, love. Yes, I feel like it's in that emotional, emotional, love. Love. Yeah. Yes, emotional yeah. love because okay. emotional love. Is you may not. The love may go like that feeling. You know, the whole butterfly. Oh, he's yeah. making you yeah. feel. Yeah. He's talking your your ah. drilling. You understand? It's Those things will go. Yeah. Those things will go. Do you understand? Awesome. But you see that friendship. Yeah. You know, that's when people bring it to okay, like maybe if you follow a woman because of how she's looking physically, I'm not going to look like this forever. Yeah, yeah. sure. Do you understand? Yeah. I mean he he, hey, well, he will not look Are you talking? <laughs> 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 he will not look like this forever. Oh, that's right. Do you understand? Oh, yes. He may not be he may not be like I can go for a <laughs> my enemy can fall sick and yeah. lose weight. Okay. I'll maybe if you like big girls i can't lose there's some sickness there's some sickness that you go through you dry you get dry yeah you understand so if you're only me because of those things those things may not be there yeah. but you know that i'm your guy even if you're in your yeah. like my shandy okay, let, 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 let's, let's you are still you my are, guy you have a good shape and then you're carried away by the shape yes uh, the lady has a good shape and then when she's old everything falls down and dows down oh my god yeah so then at that point what, what will sustain you, you? What? That's what we should think. That's, that's why it's very good for you to build this friendship over time. Because that is what will keep you when these things are not there. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, quickly, quickly, quickly. Yeah, so I have a question now, right? Because I think we have between friendship, friendship, friendship now, right? So let's let's jump into what we really mean to be friendship, right? So from this, from this context now, when we say I and Chuk now should be should build friendship right that can now help us have a um better relationship that can take us to that point of lovers much more one day what do we really say so when we say we should build friendship number one is that what do we really entail when we say that right because i've had like um I have, i've had an experience when i was in school yeah i had an um elderly lady she's married right so um though there were a kind of there were some situations there were some things that happened that so she had to call me she had called me one day, right? And she spoke to me. She was like, okay, um, guys don't really know where to draw the line between friendships, between what, what, they, what friendship means to guys and what it means to ladies. Okay, let's, let's start from, let's start from, I think we'll go there uh, much more later, but let's start from this. When we say um, we should build friendship, in this context, me and I and Chukufuna should build friendships, what do we, what do we entail, what do we mean when we say we should bring friendship, uh, when we say we should build friendship that will help us, that act as a foundation to us having a long lasting relationship, what do we really mean? First of all, be on honest grounds. Honest grounds? Uh, yes. Okay. Be truthful. Okay. Say everything from that, that beginning stage, like the friendship stage. Okay. Just let the person know. Don't need to form, no need to hide anything. Okay. Let the person know that this is who I am. Mm. Do you understand? Know that this is where I am. I cannot change you. Mm. This is where I am now. Okay. 
<laughs> now I may not. Now I'm okay. Now I'm, I'm, things may get better. But this, 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 my, this, where my head is at now. Okay. Then would try to communicate. Communication. Mm. So I'll let you know. Okay. Communication. Yes. Good communication skills and being honest and having like there's something in common that we should share. Mm. Okay. Okay. Common ground. Yes. Okay. Yes. Yes. All right. Okay. So, so Mr. Dan, what we say we should be. We should build friendships, right? In this context, when you say I and Chico Fina should build a friendship, what do you see that to be? Okay, when we are talking about friendship, if you even check your dictionary, when you type friendship, one of the first thing that comes up is support. Mm. Support. Wow. So friends support each other. They support each other. Yeah. So to to grow. Yes to explore and yeah. to be better version of themselves yeah so that is so like if i want us to have a good relationship friendship we'll start mm. by getting to knowing ourselves first mm. okay getting to knowing ourselves yes 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 yes, okay. yes 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 why is that important it's very important because if we don't know ourselves yeah we'll treat ourselves like animals mm. you know there's a saying that says when a purpose of a thing is not known, abuse is inevitable. Yeah. I can bump into your privacy, your boundaries. I can do things you don't like because we don't know each other. Mm. And that, yeah. And, and that will cause hurt. Yeah. So. Yeah. And then I'll know, I don't even know where you're heading to. Mm. So that, 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 it is, friendship is efficacious because it will help you to know this is the, this is where this person is heading to. Because if you don't know where I'm heading to, you cannot help me. You cannot support me. Mm. How can you support me when you don't know what I'm doing? Yeah, that's true. That's true. So the, the the friendship gives you a platform where we know ourselves. If I know this is what you want, this is what you want to become, I, I will support you, and then I will give you material that will enhance your growth in that field. Mm. In that field. So that's why the friendship is very is very important because we will build ourselves. Well, even the holy book says, "Iron sharpeneth iron." Mm. That's how one sharpens the countenance of his friend. Yeah. So, you cannot sharpen iron if you don't know this person is, is an iron. But I must know you. Yeah. You are iron. I'm iron. Yeah. So we sharpen ourselves. Mm. So if I come without knowing these things, without getting to know, or I'm not even bothered to know, I don't know that you you maybe you stand as wood. Mm. If I come with my iron, mm. I will chop you. Yeah, that's true. That's <laughs> yeah. True. Yeah, it's so, far stronger than that's it. That's yeah. it. And I wound your destiny. Yeah. Why? Because I never knew the kind of material you're made of. Yeah. Made up of. Yeah. So it's very important we understand ourselves. Mm. So that's why I don't even I don't even want people to be lovers at first. Get to know yourself. Mm. Get to know yourself. There are ladies I loved before. But getting to know them, I know that we don't have destiny together. together. Mm. And I left them without them knowing the, the without them knowing what the reason why I was in their life at first. <laughs> so that shows that no one will hold my call and say you broke my heart. Mm, because there was there was no um, commitment. That's it. Yeah. Because I did not rouse your emotions. <laughs> but people's emotions get roused up by themselves. <laughs> But but that one is not painful than the one I stay by myself yes, and yes. I walk away and give you a sense of that okay I'm, I am committed and then sure, much later I sure. go back. That's that's sure. on a very you can have high, high expectation on me and then if I don't show you love you too you will not be bothered than me you have high expectation and then I came rouse the emotion do mm. also if I would do stay the butterflies and then. I would say, ah, it's like God is telling me, she will know my wife. <laughs> I, I think, I think you are saying something very profound because we see a lot of experiences where people who are carried away by, um, oh, I think that thing about emotional love and yeah, you need to establish it, right? Yeah. Because we see a lot of people who are carried away from the onset, right off the bat, with emotional love, and then when they get to where the stakes matter right much more beyond and when they even achieve the highest level of intimacy in their mind so yeah. for some of them they get to a point of sex they give their bodies and yes, then yes, after yes. all that um um deja vu and all is all done then they now realize that ah so they, they they even make statements like wow i didn't know you were 
this yeah, way. I yeah. didn't know you were this type of person. Yeah, so yeah. how do they come to that point yeah. of okay? So um, I didn't know you were this. I didn't know you that. So it is because the place of friendships, right, which is where we build knowledge, mutual knowledge about each other, was skipped. Yeah, that is good. That is good that's, because that's it. Oh, okay. That's it. Okay, so knowledge. <laughs> Knowledge see, is really important. You okay. see, the, this thing you said is pivotal to this subject, because you know, when when you, you when when you don't establish this on on good grounds, you tend to move haphazardly, and then you will not move well yeah. because there are no you do not sit down and the Bible said, who who built. A mansion without sitting down to count the first count the cost yes. yes so so when you move by love emotions the you're next not thing the, cost. the next thing the next you're not counting the cost you're not trying to get to know the person the next thing is i want to touch her breast I oh yeah to, that's true i want to kiss her yes that's very important so so, so yeah. but you see when we are friends we will look at ourselves like siblings yeah at first so i'm seeing you as my sister I can see through you. Yes, I yes, 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 you yes, yes, yes. Just yes. you. I yes. can see through you. So the place yes. of friendship is, all, is also a place of maybe sharing of personhood, right? Yeah. Where I get to see you for who you are. Yeah. Because you know, you know, when, when the emotions and in, in action, the brain stops, stops working. <laughs> when the emotions and action, yeah, the, the brain, brain stops, stops working. working. <laughs> What did I just hear? <laughs> what? You guys agree? You guys agree to that? What? You know, there's what we call body chemistry. Yeah. So when you touch this body chemistry, my God, they have the potency to sus to suspend so so sus sus suspend your brain yeah. from functioning well. That's the power of body chemistry. So when the emotions, when the hem hormones are stayed up. You will not think of anything. Anytime we meet, we just want to be in a smooshy st stimulation. We just want to be in a smooshy stimulation. <laughs> <That's so laughs> <cheap. laughs> okay, guys, that's about it from uh, Master Dan and uh, Chuku Funaya. We will continue on this, but for now, right, that's a wrap from us. So we're going on with that. The place of friendship is the place where you build uh, knowledge, right? Let's yes, about. Yeah, um, both others you build knowledge so you can know how does this person communicate yeah, yeah, how does this person relate that helps to sustain um, the entire love affairs which we do know it to be so from now we're signing out we'll give you much more more points subsequently along the series thank you guys thank you for thank staying you. true to the end yeah we love you do not forget to leave laugh and love bye bye, bye.